What makes this program so unique is the fact that we have so many students from all parts of the world present here. Come to Norway, meet the world is one of our slogans. And uh, every summer we have students from around 90 countries represented. And this makes for a unique learning environment. You can study in classes where sometimes there are as many nations represented as there are students. And also in our cultural and social program you interact with, you meet with people from uh, all over the world. And I think that's uh, what makes the ISS so special and, and so unique as a study program. In my classes, there are more than all, uh, 18 students from different countries. It's a great journey for me to enhance knowledge because I am not only in my country, from uh, African countries, European countries, and US countries, different countries of all over the world, we are participating here and we make a journey, a great journey to, to understand each other, to understand their culture, their comprehend knowledge in this subject. I respect everybody and each other, respect each other. So I think in the uh, uh, in here, I get a lot of information, a lot of knowledge that will enhance my capacity and that I will help life in my country. And I think we have nine nationalities in a class of about 20 people, or maybe we're a little bit more, but uh, or along the lines of that. And uh, we have people from Eastern Europe, from America, from uh, all over Europe, and elsewhere as well. And it's great, I mean, people, opinions you never usually hear in the media or in your day-to-day -day life. I study in North America, so most people are from North America. So in that sense, I've been really pleased with what I've gotten to hear, and both on a cultural level about what they tell me about Norway, but also feedback from their own country. And uh, in terms of that multicultural aspect, I've been really happy with the ISS. What has ISS taught me? First, we have the academic life, and it's very enriching to learn new things in this particular university, in this particular school, and our teacher is very great. Um, the courses that are being offered to students really help a lot in developing ourselves professionally, and of course, in developing our skills as professionals. Um, the fact that you have students from such different backgrounds from all over the world, they all come to the ISS for, the, for their own reasons, um, but yet, you know, we're, we're here together um, sharing uh, somehow, uh, you know, the, the same issues, looking at them though in different sorts of ways. Um, as a teacher, that's a really a, a privilege and not one that uh, uh, is easy to, uh, to find elsewhere. And, and so, uh, yeah, I mean, I can't actually imagine now somewhere without the ISS. Uh, you know, I do hear that people have holidays, uh, but, you know, coming here is, is, is worth so much. What I think is so unique about a school like the ISS is the multicultural setting, of course. And uh, also just the compound where people are living. It's just a close contact uh, with all the students all the time. So I think maybe the most important thing that you learn, and I hope so, happens outside the classroom. So for me, I feel the classroom is almost just an addition to everything else. All the conversations that happen over lunch and, and the meeting at cultural evening. And, and I think that's what an international summer school should be about. There's one thing that I learned very best in this particular school, the concept of Ubuntu, which means that I am because you are, or we are, and because we are, I am. And this means belongingness, acceptance, empathy, and understanding. And although this particular saying is a cliche, but still we can have unity in diversity. And I might, I might be asking something about it because 
the concept of world peace in the world now is not so good and in international summer school we can really see peace and unity and why can't we apply this particular friendship and acceptance and unity to the whole world so that we can achieve world peace and world peace? Last night, as a cultural evening, that was amazing. How, how much energy and, and the love and passion uh, with people that all over the world has shown. And for me, it was like a great experience just to see that. We are students who are able to mobilize themselves and show you their talents in music, dance, and singing. And I was also able to participate as a person with disability. I was not excluded. So that's made me very happy and I like ISS for being inclusive. Thank you. This experience of the global village with people from all over the world uh, really made them look at the world, look at themselves, look at the people around them in a different perspective. And I hope everyone who's been to the summer school and who comes to the summer school will leave with this new perspective on the world as a result of their six weeks here. So, I said it changed my life in a very good way. But I meet here some people, actually a lot of people, make friendships and um, I will never forget this time here. I was a student at ISS in 2003. When I was a student there, somebody told me if somebody comes to ISS, that person will come back again. So I have been working for fifth year in a for ISS and I think that saying is true. International Summer School is six weeks of your life that you are never going to forget.